What's going on YouTube? Tin Can Gardener here. I uh, wanted to do an update on these tomatoes I planted. <clears throat> these are supposedly ugly ripes. I just hope I can have a different seed marked in a different package because I save a lot of my own seeds. And sometimes with tomatoes you get got too many things going on at once. Uh, it is possible to plant the wrong seed but I'm pretty sure these are ugly ripes. They have big potato leaves. They get pretty big. And they're not uh, producing like a saucing tomato would per se. But these tomatoes are interesting because part of the tomato contest on who can grow the biggest tomato. And as you can see I'm getting some blossom end rot. So I got something to fix that. Uh, probably do some Epsom salt. A little bit of eggshells. I've already put eggshells in there so I guess more. Um... These are my daughter's plants. They're doing pretty good. She's getting flowering. We'll see how this works out. Um, my unmanaged yard. Um, I don't cut down the weeds because the bees that I have are usually hitting up all these flowers and giving me good uh, honey from it. So I will eventually cut them down, just not right at the moment. That heap of mess right there are all dragon fruits that need to be cut and put into pots to get rid of. Um, these are my jalapeno plants. They're doing actually pretty good. I got on this one, one, two, three, four, five, maybe a few more. And I got a couple ready for cuttings. Um, over here's a nice one. That's a nice pepper. So, and I have some... Uh, yard long beans right here growing up this trellis uh, or noodle beans whatever you call them and I get ant problems on them all the time because of aphids so I gotta spray them again uh, something going on looks like some kind of maybe white fly or something going on over here uh, it could be a uh, fungus or could be blight I hope not but anyways I got a few jalapenos over here I'm gonna have to come out and start picking these things here's my other jalapeno plants they seem to be doing okay they don't mind being this close together um, and then over here I planted some beans and I put a couple collard greens back there and there's radishes in here but the real problem here is keeping the weeds out because the weeds love growing in these boxes and they'll find a way in, they'll grow up and over and in. It's just the uh, nature of the beast, I guess. But, yep, that's what's going on with this bed. So, just wanted to show you guys that. And this is my black sapote. It looks sick. Probably because, well, pest problems we have Sri Lanka weevils but that's what the fruit looks like whenever it starts out if the bugs don't get them all which they might you never know so all right guys that's a quick update of what I got growing in these two gardens I'll do another one later with my other garden all right check it out